Hello everyone. In this video, I will show you three ways, three easy ways to learn Altrix. When you are inside the Altrix environment, notice the palette which has so many different tools. If you click on any one tool once, it opens up a drop down menu. And against that, we'll find a simple definition. In addition, we also see a hyperlink which will allow you to get one example on the canvas area. The Altrix team has done a very good job in documenting the steps. What does each container tool do? And this can be taken as a very good example to start learning. Second, you go to the help section and there's something called sample workflows. When you start exploring the various options given, you'll realize these are based on frequently asked questions, such as clean and prepare data, measure the quality of data, now, you may not know the exact tool which will help you do that. However, as a user, you can easily correlate with the problem. As you click on it, you will get a sample workflow which will have elements with a case study, which you can click on individually to find out what they are doing. Plus, you get short descriptions against each case study. Who says the best things in life don't come for free? So now let me talk about the third easy step. If you remember any tool name and forgot in which part of the palette it was placed, you can go to the search box and just type in browse or the name of the tool that you are searching for. You'll get the browse and along with that, an example. In addition, if you are connected to the internet, you'll find plenty of resources on the topic that you made the search on. And the best part, you can also pick up the tool and drag and drop it to the main container or the workflow. So friends, these were the three easy ways to learn Altrex faster and better.